Hola amigos, welcome back to Learn Spanish World with Mr. Briggs. Bienvenidos. Hoy vamos a aprender, today we're going to learn how to say guess what in Spanish. And in order to accomplish this, we're going to see a series of different phrases in which we can use this specific question. Guess what? It is a very popular common expression which can be used in the least expected moment. When you least expect it, you can actually hear somebody asking you, guess what? Or you could tell somebody, hey, guess what? So we're going to learn a few interesting and important sentences. I venture to say these are some of the most commonly used sentences asking guess what? So stay tuned in order to learn this and how to use them. But before we continue, I wanted to invite you to click that button. Look how close we are. We almost 100,000 subscribers. I cannot believe it. Peñiscame, pinch me. This is amazing. Our community is growing. And I have to thank you for your loyalty and your support throughout all these years. My main goal is to help you learn Spanish. I cover a wide range of topics like pronunciation, grammar, vocabulary. And by subscribing, you make it possible for me to eventually dedicate myself to creating videos for you. As a school teacher, it's sometimes so hard to find the time. But anyway, with your help, we'll make it possible. Okay, amigos, let's commence. Let's learn how to say, guess what, in Spanish. Today's video is entitled, how to say, guess what, in Spanish. So make sure that you watch this video a few times in order to reinforce the phrases the sentences that you're just about to learn. It's also very important to post and to pronounce aloud. Save it in your list and practice every day. Muy bien, let us begin. Comencemos. Now, before we commence, it's super important for me to mention that you need to listen, escúchame, listen to me, y copia mi pronunciación, and copy my pronunciation. Try to do this aloud. If you practice aloud, you'll be able to get the correct pronunciation faster. So, muy importante, escúchame y repite. Excelente. Comencemos. Guess what in Spanish is adivina qué. Adivina qué. That means, guess what? Adivina qué. If you want to ask, guess what is it? You can say, adivina que es. Adivina que es. I'll say it muy despacio. Adivina que es. Adivina que es. Guess what it is, or guess what is it? Guess which? Adivina cuál? Adivina cuál? Repite. Adivina cuál? Guess which? Adivina cuál? Next one. Siguiente. Guess what I got, or guess what I have. Adivina que tengo. Adivina que tengo. Adivina que tengo. Adivina que tengo. Guess what I have. Can you say it? Adivina que tengo. Muy bien. Siguiente ejemplo. Next example. Guess what I'm doing. Adivina qué estoy haciendo. Adivina qué estoy haciendo. Adivina qué estoy haciendo. We tend to join words in Spanish also. So we say, 
Adivina qué estoy haciendo. Another example. Guess what I bought or guess what I purchased. Adivina qué compré. Adivina qué compré. Guess what I bought. Adivina qué compré. Una vez más. Adivina qué compré. Another popular example. Guess who I saw. Adivina a quién vi. Adivina quién vi. Guess who I saw. Adivina quién vi. Can you say that? I'll say it very slowly. Adivina a quién vi. Guess what I'm eating. Adivina que estoy comiendo. We tend to join the que and estoy together. Que estoy. Adivina que estoy comiendo. That makes you sound more native. Adivina que estoy comiendo. So instead of saying adivina que estoy comiendo, we join the words. Adivina que estoy comiendo. Guess what he or she said. Adivina que dijo. Adivina que dijo. Adivina que dijo. Guess what he or she said. Let's review. Adivina que. Guess what. Adivina que. Adivina qué. Repite. Repeat after me. Adivina qué. Una vez más. One more time. Adivina qué. Adivina qué. Guess what? Muy bien. It's time to practice our Spanish listening exercises. So how did you go? Where the phrases Fácil, easy, o were they difícil, difficult, or moderadas, moderate? Let me know in the comments. I want to know what you think or what you thought. I want to know what you thought about these phrases. Okay, now the time has come for us to practice our listening skills in Spanish. At the count of three. Uno, dos, tres. Adivina qué. Ahora vamos a practicar el español. Voy a hablar en español y tú me vas a escuchar. Adivina qué. Hoy es viernes y este fin de semana podré trabajar en mis videos para este canal. Muy pronto vamos a alcanzar 100,000 suscriptores. ¡Wow! Imagínate. Y adivina qué. Voy a celebrar con ustedes. Ese momento especial cuando alcancemos los 100,000 suscriptores. Ah, y adivina qué. Tengo un video casi listo. Es un video que te ayudará a descansar y relajarte escuchando palabras en español a fin de mejorar tu vocabulario y tu pronunciación. Muy pronto lo subiré a YouTube. También, adivina qué, voy a subir un video con mis vacaciones para compartir contigo tierras lejanas, aventuras en otros países a la vez que aprendes español junto conmigo. Y eso no es todo. Adivina qué, voy a traer mi guitarra y voy a cantar una canción para ti, a fin de practicar el español. Y adivina qué, muy pronto volveré a subir lecciones de gramática. Así es que prepárate, porque voy a explicar la gramática del español de una forma simple, de una forma fácil de entender. 
nada de cosas complicadas aquí. Mientras más simple, más fácil sea para ti comprender, mucho mejor. Muy bien, amigos. How did you go? Were you able to understand what I was saying? Fantástico. Now, if you didn't, as I always say to you, that's not a reason for you to be discouraged. Learning a language takes time. Keep at it. Do not give up. But muy importante, don't give up, because a lot of people get all psyched up and they say, oh, I'm going to learn this language, and one week goes by and, and they give up. No, 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 no. Learning a language takes time and patience. So if you set aside, you know, maybe 10 minutes a day, but you really focus, you will be able to improve your Spanish within a year. So it's muy importante que seas consistente. You need to be consistent. I know some of you wanted to see Kiko again. I haven't forgotten about it. I've just been super busy at work, but I'm almost done. So that video is coming. Okay, my dear amigos, take care, cuídate, and see you soon. Chao, chao.